So I have ten dollars. Ten dollars on there for I think it's yep. F. And then pink, which is what's that? Three dollars? Okay. Cool. Alrighty, thirteen. Okay. Thank, thank you, you very much. Have a great day. You too. Thanks. Excuse me? Well, I, I, uh, yeah. Sorry to interrupt. No, do, do you know if these have been unlinked from the Cricut? Or if they're still linked? Uh, I don't think they were ever linked because they're just the cartridge that went in. Okay. All right. I never used like the computer software portion on those. Gotcha. So I just loaded the cartridge directly into the machine and used it that okay. way. Okay. I've just heard that sometimes they get linked to like the one Cricut and then they can't oh, be used. Really? So. Yeah, so I'm not sure. Can I just make a pile yeah, right here awesome. and then awesome. You can set it right here if okay. you want. Yeah, I appreciate it. Yeah, I don't, I've never heard that. Yeah, I usually just pass up on unused ones just in case, because you never know. Yeah, so, yeah. Appreciate absolutely. it. There's a bed for these little babies. I think I'm good. Right. A dollar fifty on there. Thank you. Six dollars. All right. Your prices are awesome. Oh, thanks. <laughs> Some garage sale prices. A lot of people want to price stuff way up, you know. I, I struggle with that, and I'm like, well, some things may be a little over, some may be a little under. I guess right. we even out when yeah, it's all Yeah, exactly. Done. Thank you. Yeah, thank you so much. Thanks. What'd you have on the shoes? And? Um, two dollars. Okay, sounds good. Those are really cool. I didn't know they made Ohio State themed ones. That's awesome. Thank you very much. Thank you. Have a great day. You too. Thanks. That's pretty cool. I don't know. It feels feels pretty light. <laughs> oh, it looks like it's in there. Let's see. Okay. Mm -mm.
Yeah? Yeah. Yeah. What would you ask on something like that? Okay, I'm gonna do that. I hope that was intended to be sold. Yeah, I mean, I'm just going through your cabinet. Okay, <laughs> hoping I'm not just going through your cabinets. Like, oh, <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> All right. Well, thank you so much. Yeah, Have sure. a great day. Thank you. Thanks. Can I pay you? Sure. Awesome. There's three dollars. All right. Appreciate Thank you. It. Thank you. Did you want your hanger? I'll take it if you don't All want right. it. There you are. Thank you. Thank you. All right, guys, I'm walking away from a sale. They were playing music, but I got this North Face jacket, and I usually don't pick up North Faces anymore unless they are downfilled. And usually you can tell on North Faces that they are downfilled when they have a number on the front. The higher the number, the more fill it has, or, or the more dense the fill, or something like that. Um, and yeah, the more it's gonna be worth. So 550, I think that's decent. Um, and it's a vest, so it's not gonna be as expensive as like a normal coat. But uh, yeah, for three bucks, that should be good. How's it going? Good, how are you? Doing good, thanks. Is this, is this $10 with the guitars? You have $10 on there. Is it with the guitars for it? Sure. Okay, I appreciate it. Yeah, no worries. And then, uh, do you know what they were asking? Oh, $3, cool. Did, did you have any other gaming stuff? Um, I think that's it. That's it? Okay. Yeah. Alright, well I'll give you ten dollars for that. I appreciate that. Awesome, yeah, enjoy. Yeah, for sure. Just went to another sale. Uh, they had a bunch of kids out there and people holding their babies, that kind of stuff. So I put the camera down. Um, I found something I've never found before. I know racing gear is usually pretty good. Um, never heard of this brand. I thought it said Zemp at first and nothing was coming up but it's zamp z-a-m-p uh so when i look up zamp jackets um i don't see any used ones that are sold i don't think but uh they're selling new for around like 150 180 i'm pretty sure so for ten dollars um i mean even if we can get 50 bucks that's an awesome flip as another sale another radio playing we paid ten dollars for a pair of uggs that look like they've honestly like barely been used super nice condition uh, i think these yeah double bow um those usually sell really well for me especially when they're in such good condition and then i got an eddie bauer jacket we paid five dollars a piece on these if i haven't mentioned that this is a weather edge goose down uh once again i only pick up jackets uh for the most part as long as they're goose down um, and you can tell that right here it says insulation goose down um, and I do well with Eddie Bauer goose down so and we are coming up on winter which is crazy time is flying so that'll be good eventually all right guys we made it back from the sales so I think we grinded out a pretty solid day uh, as once again quality over quantity but I'll take that and uh, we went up to Piccawa, Ohio which is about an hour north for me and I was super surprised you guys the support is heavy out there. I appreciate it. I met a ton of you guys out there and that's probably the most I've ever been recognized in one area. So it means a lot. Um, and then we headed south into Troy once we got done with Piccawa. It was a community sale and then Troy had a couple sales. Uh, kind of sign chased and ran into a couple good things. Um, but yeah, we grinded out a solid day and let me show you the finds. All right, uh, I think this might've been the first thing I picked up, but it was definitely at the first sale you guys saw, uh, this vintage Robbins and Myers fan. Um, I've learned to pick these up because the guy that I source with a good amount of times, Jamie, you guys have seen him a lot. Uh, he picks up these vintage fans when he does see them. And this thing is in pretty darn good condition, uh, cosmetically at least. Functionally, I'll show you. Uh, let's see, I got it plugged in. Let's turn this on.
See, like, once it gets going, it sounds all right. I guess it does rattle still, but the startup is definitely not the greatest. Um, but even for parts, these things sell. Um, I think since it's working, it just might need a little bit of... I don't know if I could pop this off and, like, tighten a bolt or something. It just sounds like the, the blades are hitting the cage. Um, either way, I think that's at least 100 uh, maybe 150 plus shipping. So that's awesome for $10. Got these really cool uh, Ohio State Nike Flywear shoes. I didn't even know they made Ohio State-specific ones. Um, not sure what they're actually worth, but for $2, I'll pick those up. And they're in pretty good condition. They're just dirty. Uh, so I'll give those a quick wash. Picked up these Uggs for 5 bucks. They look barely used. Um, and we got winter coming up, so those should sell really good. Um, the ones with the ribbons on the back seem to do well for me. Picked up this baseball bat. Uh, when you guys see these bats that are like almost like two pieces uh they got that little separation right there um what are these called uh what, what is that called composite yeah composite um you want to pick those up usually they're pretty good especially for a dollar fifty i mean this is like an eighty dollar plus shipping bat i think uh there's the model number right there and then Marini also just super good um and then this guitar hero ps4 this is uh i think the last thing we found that was down in troy and that was like 11 o'clock that was still sitting there couldn't even believe it two guitars the game and then like the most important part right here is that dongle uh that goes for any guitar hero that does require a dongle that's going to be the majority of your money right there uh make sure that's there um so i think the game and one guitar for the bundle was like a hundred dollars and then maybe i could sell another guitar for um I, I don't know curious what that's gonna bring but that was awesome for ten dollars picked up this lennox christmas tree i know some lennox stuff can be crazy money um i don't expect this to be anything crazy what did we pay i think three dollars or something like that no we paid six dollars for that so we'll see um, got a garage door opener for three bucks at the same sale with the fan. Uh, I saw this overhead door code Dodgers. Those things were going for decent money. So we'll see. Uh, another sale just had some really cool stuff. Um, got this, uh, Cricut SpongeBob SquarePants. The only reason I picked it up was because it's brand new sealed. I don't know if you heard me talking to her. I was asking if the ones that weren't new were unlinked. And I've just heard in the past that they can get linked to, uh, certain cricket machines and then it basically renders them useless for any other machine let me know is that accurate um but yeah for i think we paid a dollar on this uh that's i think an easy 50 bucks right there and then at the same sale we got a lennox ornament bop it uh, we're all in six dollars at her sale so we definitely couldn't go wrong big mouth billy bass in probably the best condition i've ever found one of these in um and then I don't know if this is from her sale or not, but uh, I think it was. It's got some shaving stuff. I thought these refills were going to be more than what they actually are. They're not worth selling on their own, um, but that's okay because we'll put these to use. These things are a lot of money in stores. Um, and then shaving cream, you know, whatever. That saved us money right there. And then some clothing. You guys already heard the explanation on this North Face. Same with the Eddie Bauer jacket. And then same with that jacket. But something that I didn't explain was this Adidas, uh, not jacket, but it's like a zip-up hoodie. Um, got the LA Lakers on there, the association. Um, I couldn't find any solds to reflect this, but the listings are pretty high. I saw around like 60 to over 100 for some of the listings. So for $3, I don't know. We'll see. It just looked like something that was quality and something that I've never seen before. So, yeah, curious what that's going to bring. So, yeah, I think we grinded out a pretty solid day. I'm definitely happy with what we found. We got some really good quality stuff. Um, and then clothing isn't my favorite, but when it's there and when there's not a whole lot else to pick up, I'm going to pick it up when I see it for the right price. Um, so, yeah, I appreciate you guys for watching. Thank you so much, and you have a great day.